let's uh, say you have a backend system that's relying on a bunch of GitOps to be able to, uh, to, to do its work. GitHub itself is either fully or partially blocked in China a significant percentage of the time. So you're gonna have all kinds of issues with just deploying and reliably getting content over there, unless you're monitoring it. Um, the other problem, your analytics are probably way off. So if you're like, oh, I only get 2% of my traffic from China. Well, the problem is, is that you, you might be losing anywhere from one out of two to, to, to uh, tons of, of your GTM traffic. Uh, additionally, your Adobe Analytics traffic is, uh, is, unless you do specific actions to make sure that your, um, that your DTM tags fire in China, you're probably not gonna be getting any analytics in China. So, so that datum of I don't get traffic in China may be entirely wrong. Additionally, if you're trying to measure like RUM metrics in China, so all the big uh, providers like your Datadog and your New Relic and your Dynatrace and so forth, they all don't work in China. They all say that they don't work in China. Uh, so it's a little bit tough to say, good, well, how, what is actually my performance? So um, <laughs> additionally, so global CDNs aren't in China. Fastly, Cloudflare, CloudFront, Azure Front Door, Akamai, they all don't have local points of presence in China. Um, Akamai exited the Chinese market last year. Uh, closest you can get is near China. And then also, just so you know too, so, so everybody knows that, or most people know that Hong Kong is politically a part of China. Hong Kong, from a network perspective, is not part of China. So if you have stuff hosted in Hong Kong, you're not in China. 